around me for miles. I mean, that I can see there are some houses, nobody there. In the summertime, there's some people around, but... How cold I is it? I don't go to town. I go to town maybe once a week to get mail and groceries. How how far is your, I mean, how cold is your house? I mean, well, how cold yeah. is, the, is the temperature? Right now, it's, when I left, it was about 12 Fahrenheit, which is about minus 15 Celsius. Oh, my God. Minus 10, I guess. So it snows. Huh? It snows. It must be snowing. Well. Constant. It can. Constant. It wasn't. Actually, it snows more when it's a little warmer. Really? The normal, the average temperature for January is 25 degrees, which would be minus 4 Celsius. That's the average high for January. The low is about, be about minus 12 Celsius, I'm guessing. I don't know Celsius that well, but I know 0 and 32 Zero Celsius is 32 Fahrenheit. So about minus four is the average high in January. It's cold. Mm -hmm. It's cold, but it's not humid like here. You don't have a lot of moisture in the air. So if you put on really warm clothes, it, it keeps it keeps you out, keeps it out. Yeah. But you don't go, you know, you go, we go out, we go ice skating and, and skiing and. It's cold in here. It's cold. We have bonfires outside down on the lake. My and my kids, all the all their buddies, the girls and guys, they have sleigh riding. Do they? And then have a and they have a bonfire going down and they sleigh ride and then they come inside at the end. You'll but yeah, I've had sometimes 12, 15 kids up on my road. So know. is it? So it's not constant snow. I thought no, like, it's not I snow thought, all the time. I thought that where you lived, it was all like mountains and it was just full of snow. Apart from the sun. Well, there are mountains, but I'm in the valley. It's a big valley. Oh. And uh, I'm in the mountains. <clears throat> There's always snow in the mountains. Yeah. Uh, from, I mean, you, some of the mountains have snow all year. Yeah. You know. High, high. But uh, I'm curious, too. I don't know. It could. I could come back, and there could be buried in snow. Or I could come back, and there'll be not that much. <laughs> you know, I... It, it it changes. Last winter, we didn't have that much snow. This winter, it's been about average. But I missed the coldest month. Well, February, January and February. Yeah. So every vehicle I have, Except I have a sports car. Every vehicle is a four-wheel drive. Yeah. Have to. So do you have to? So to travel into town, you have to like go through the mountains yeah. to get there. To take you a long time. No. No, it's only twelve miles. Fifteen yeah. miles, twelve, fifteen miles into town. So. It's a little town, about a thousand people, twelve hundred people. Oh, right. So it's like more like a village. Village, of... exactly. It is called a village, actually. The, the nearest town is uh, 30, about 40 miles. There's a town of about 30, 25,000. That's the biggest town in that part of... That's the closest big town. The, is to that go like to a, a bigger city? town, you have to go 200 miles. What's that for? To, to like... A city? Great Falls. Yeah, about... Great Falls is 65,000, 70,000. The biggest mm. town in Montana is 85,000 people. Mm. In the state, you know. It's like, you have counties, right? Like uh, uh, Su yeah, Suffolk, huh? Yeah, but Essex is a county. Essex is a county, and yeah. Uh, Kent is a county. And, yeah. Well, we have... So it's like... We have counties too, actually. Mon Mon Every state has counties. So we have counties and then we have places inside the counties. Right. Areas. Like, Areas, yeah. yeah. It's amazing to me. I meet English people that haven't been all over England, like to the Lake Country or 
down south or way up north. Yeah, no. Because, you know, as big as America is, I've been to every part of it, Dri driving. When I was your age, I'd get in my old car and just drive. <laughs> Camp, drive all over, drove all over every place. The only place I haven't been is Alaska, which is weird because my brother used to live there. Alaska's really cold, isn't it? But some of it's warmer than Montana. Warmer. They get the weather from Jap Japan. Is Alaska Jap up, up in the north? Yeah, way up north. It's not connected to the rest of the United States. There's a piece of Canada in between. I thought that. I thought it might have been something to do with Canada. Yeah. I'm going to go and see my uncle in Canada. Resort? Oh, I love it. It's to unbelievable. Come. And in the summer, <coughs> excuse me. In the summer, you ride the, the chair lifts all the way up, and they have glaciers year-round. Glacier. People be skiing there. You can go up there and walk around. It's really beautiful. It's, it's just fabulous. It's so you fun. can ski in the summer, too? You, they go up skiing. The, the ski teams train up there on the glaciers way up top. But you can go, you know, you just get on the chair. It's a beautiful ride. You ride for like 25 minutes all the way up, all the way up. Oh. And you can see everything. It's not very far from Vancouver. Well, I, I want to go skiing, but Ted can't go, obviously, because he's got his football and stuff. They're yeah. Not, they're not allowed to. Does he ski? He's not allowed. But does he know how? No, because he's never been. Right. But I've when he retires, that's something you can you guys definitely can yeah. I because I love going skiing. I used to go every year. Well, Ted can't go, so it's really good exercise too. Yeah, it's fun. I love it. It's so much fun. <laughs> I used to I started going. Then the year after that, I asked my mum and dad if we could go on a skiing holiday. And they, so they thought, well, why not? We might as well. So then they come with me one year, and then that was it. We've just been every year since. That was it. Then you went by, yeah. So I went with the school. Then I went home and told my mum and dad how great it was. So then we went as a family, and then we've been going as a family every, every year since. We went for New Year. It was amazing. And they, they put on a big show. The ski, the ski coaches and ski stuff. patrol with the lights. Yeah, and they all come because the hotel, the hotel where we stay in, um, in Andorra, you can ski into our hotel. You ski down the mountain into the hotel. So they were skiing down, down into the hotel. Yeah. And they did like a big show. It was amazing. Fun, isn't it? Yeah, I love it. I'm getting excited now. I want to go skiing. <laughs> I don't. Oh yeah. Me too. Why? Well, we have skiing all around me. It's yeah. like we have two ski areas that are like 45 minutes. Just drive. There, you know. And one of them's a one of them's a really big, big place. But uh, this 